Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It is a beautiful Wednesday morning and we're going to be bringing you some broken XP today. Follow along with the steps in the video just like every day and you, just like the people in my community, can reach that level 350 in no time. We still have over a month left on the season and we're already level 352. All it is is from following these maps every day, so definitely hit that sub with notifications turned on so you never miss another XP guide in the future. But to get started today, all you have to do is open your game library and you're going to paste in the code 79894922-3800. Go ahead and type that in just like I did and you should see the OG gun game map which we jump in pretty often. It was updated with the new XP location so we are going to be jumping right in for you. Look for this purple XP sticker on the left hand side. If you see that, you are good to go. So now that we have all that ready to go, we can hit select, change it to a private game and then we're ready to get started. All right, everybody, and just like before, you're going to spawn in a random location in this map, but that's okay. It's going to be really easy for us to all get to the same location. So no matter where you spawned, basically you want to look for this big blue building with the windmill on top because that's going to help you find this Star Wars building. It has tires on the side, a big open rectangle door just like this. This is the building you want to be next to, right next to this orange container. So as soon as you do make it over here where I'm standing, all you want to do is walk over to this metal pipe here, and there's not going to be any buttons on it right now. But as soon as you do that emote, as you can see, turning to the right will make that secret button appear. So stand by the metal pipe, do any emote, and then look up out towards the water for a secret button. And as soon as you push on this button, it's going to teleport us to the timer room. Once you're in this room, all you have to do is push the button that's on the door to start that countdown. And this countdown is going to be charging up those XP buttons for us. So the entire time we're waiting, it is building up the XP that those buttons give. Because the longer we're in the map, the more XP the buttons will give us. But while this is counting down, you want to go to the left side, run all the way across this bridge area here, and you're going to see these two baskets. Just look at the basket on the right side for another secret button. When you push on this button, you should notice that the AFK XP starts to count up. That AFK XP button is on every single map, and basically it's just going to give you XP the entire time you're waiting, so you're at least getting something for the time we spend in here. So do whatever you need to do to get ready for your day. I'll be seeing you guys right back here in about 10 minutes when this timer says zero. All right, guys, thank you so much. If you made it this far, you are now ready to get that free XP. So for the first thing you want to do is run forward to this wood tower building here and you're going to mantle up and then just look to the left and look right at these metal containers. And that's going to be the first secret button for us to push today. As you can see, I am getting a few hundred XP, even a thousand sometimes every few seconds. And I do believe I am getting limited XP because I did two XP glitches yesterday and I'm already level 352. But I'm curious how much XP you guys are going to get. So let me know in the comments when we're done with this map. So while that continues to count up for us, the next glitch we're going to do is you're going to jump off this building. You're going to mantle up to this wood balcony and then you're going to mantle up one more time onto the roof. So from here, you want to wrap around. You're going to see this big metal pipe that's on top of the roof. Just look at the end of it on the right side and you should see the second secret XP button appear. And as soon as you push on that button there, you should be good to move on to the next one while that starts to count for us. You're going to jump off this building, turn to the right. Or actually, I should say turn around, not turn to the right, but you're going to jump off the building, turn around, go inside the door that is on the purple wall. As soon as you walk in, immediately turn to the right, look at the bookshelf, and that's going to be your third XP boost of this map. Perfect, perfect. Now, I know it's not as much XP as I usually get on these maps. However, it is still a decent chunk to get for doing no work while I was getting ready for work today. So to move on from here, you want to jump out of this building. You're going to jump off this balcony here and wrap around the corner of the brick building on there. Once you make it around the corner, you should see the Noms grocery store and inside you are going to notice an ATM machine. Walk up to that ATM machine and push on the button that appears. And finally, for the next boost, you want to go underneath the staircase here, turn to the right and then go left. You're going to go outside to the wayfront of all the buildings. And once you're out front, you want to go inside the door that has that blue tarp hanging over the top of it. And once you're inside this little laundry room, look to the left, right above, right next to the bookshelf or right next to the window on top of this washing machine, you will find that final XP button. So thank you to everyone who watched all the way to the end. We got 60,000 XP and all we had to do was push five buttons. It took about two minutes. So I definitely hope this helped someone out there get some free battle pass rewards. Let me know in the comments how much XP you ended up getting. I got to get running to work, but I hope to see you all when I'm off work in about eight hours. And I'll be seeing you guys in the live stream saying what's up. Peace out.